Adam Calhoun, we were young. Let's go. Oh, oh, hold up. Social media, the poison, take your feelings and exploit it. If you don't get the likes, somehow you feel less important. You can't beat them, join them. Fuck that, I'll beat them and enjoy it. I uh. build my own shit, it's only me who can't destroy it. Mm. The devil is alive, look in the palm of your hand. Everyone you know on the phone, they post on Instagram. Yep. Little girls turn to hoes, exposed on OnlyFans. Know how to break the home, get rid of the only man. Facts. This nigga spitting already. Is there lyrics to this anywhere? Cause this nigga spitting. What did he just say? That nigga was spitting, bro. He was spitting real bars in that. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Let's run that back. Let's run that verse back. Cause that nigga said some shit. I need to go through that again. Hold up. Hold up. Social media, the poison, take your feelings and exploit it. If you don't get the likes, somehow you feel less important. You can't beat them, join them. I'd rather that, beat them and enjoy it. it. Nigga, word playing up in there? That was nice. You can't beat them, beat them, join them. Fuck that, I'll beat them and enjoy it, nigga. What? That was nice. Uh, he's also right. Social media is, is ridiculous. It is. Uh, coming from someone who's been on social media, I remember when I started my started my channel and social media and everything, everything like that. Like, you get likes. And then you want to get more likes. And if you get less likes, you feel bad about it. And it's like, you don't control the algorithm. It's an algorithm that's actually, it's made to control people's brains. People like the same things because the algorithm tells them to like it. People don't, people ignore the same things because the algorithm tells them that thing isn't important. So whenever that topic comes up, don't, don't acknowledge it. Don't, don't talk about it. Don't like it. Don't comment on it. You know, it, it, it feeds off of negativity. It feeds off of uh, provocativeness. It feeds off of sex. It feeds off of violence. It feeds off of hatred. It feeds off of arguing. feeds off of negativity. And that's just a real thing. That's a real thing. And then it feeds off of, like, like uh, performative, like, uh, charity. You know what I mean? Or you got people who, who actually will... It's, it's like they're hacking your brain. They know what people... They know people, people do like positivity, so when someone does something really positive, it's usually, like, there's some kind of sinister thing behind it a lot of times. People will post, like, there's videos of people who post uh, animals trapped to get animals out of that trap situation, like a turtle wrapped up in something or something like that. And then you find out they're wrapping the turtle up just to unwrap the turtle in the video to get millions of likes like look i'm saving this animal put a monkey wrap it up put it in like a, a vice or something get it out of the vice like oh who put this monkey in a vice and it's like well, i just saved this monkey for millions of views and mad money people feed that so now you're feeding an animal you're feeding animal abuse and it's like they're hacking your brain they know what people want to see or what people will react to it's not even what you want to see because even the things you claim you don't want to see you're still engaging with so they'll still put it in front of you in order to get that engagement because the engagement is what matters because there's ads on every post anyway let's continue this nigga spitting facts it's facts i built my own shit it's only me who can't destroy it the devil is alive look in the palm of your hand everyone you know on the phone they post on instagram little girls turn to hoes exposed on only fans know how to break the home get rid of the only man another fact another fact uh feminism is spread throughout welfare feminism get the kid get the father out of the home but also even on social media feminism is allowed but if you say the opposite you're a bigot. If you if you if you say I don't like naked bitches, they'll call you all different types of names. They'll say you like men. They'll say you don't like women. They'll say you're you're you're, you're you treat women like possessions. They'll say all these things. But then in the future, you'll see women be like, "Oh, I wish I never did that thing." And then you're supposed to support that too, and be like, "Oh yeah, but remember when I told you you shouldn't have been doing it in the first place because you're giving everything out for free? Who's gonna want something that everyone can have? The more like, of course you're gonna get more likes." You know what I mean? When things are easier to access, it goes down in value and it gets mass produced. You know what I mean? That's how that's just how it goes. That's just how things work. If everything can if everyone can have something, of course more people are gonna have it, but also more people people won't care about it because everyone can have it. That's just how that's just how the world works. So if you are putting 
if your nudity is making you money online, obviously people want to see it. So imagine if you had a man that was like, that that wanted to see it by himself, he would feel like he had gold because he's the only one who could see it. You know what I mean? Oh, this is way more important because I'm the only one who could see it. But if everyone could see it, then it's not. You know what I mean? That's just how it works. You know? When we were young, I wish you could have seen Running out the house, playing in the street Didn't care what they were saying on TV I miss the world and the way it used to be Used to be Miss the world and the way it used to be Used to be Miss the world and the way it used to be Used to be Miss the world and the way it used to be Before they poisoned us and gave us all this disease Comments make me ill, I can feel it in my health I'm my biggest hater, take these pills now I can't feel myself Why you rather see me die, listen to the shit I write I ain't a black rapper, I can still kill a mic Run the jewels, keep your flowers, I ain't trying to hear my hype my I ain't a black my, I ain't a black rapper, I can still kill a mic Killer mic, run the jewels Come on bro, come on bro Let's run that back Comments make me ill, I can feel it in my health I'm my biggest hater, take these pills now I can't feel myself Why you rather see me die, listen to the shit I write I ain't a black rapper, I can still kill a mic One of two Bro, hold up, let me run it back again, my bad That first part, that first shit, I kind of went over it He kind of bodied that What do you say, comments make me ill First he said, before they poisoned us and killed us with this disease Or gave us all this disease And he said, comments make me ill uh, I can feel it in my health uh, I'm my biggest hater. Take these pills. Now I can't feel myself. That's literally the human condition in America. Maybe, maybe the world. Maybe the world. Maybe the world. But definitely in America. Big Farmer runs America, bro. Runs America. You read comments. And, and bro, it's there's so many there's so many aspects. This is a multi multifaceted attack on humans, bro. Because social media is a it's it's a it's a double edged sword because People like Adam, like, you can make millions of dollars. You put your music on there. You put yourself on there. You make your skits and things like that. You get a lot of engagement from it, right? You, gotta, you get a lot of love. But then you get a negative comment. And then you forget that you, when you're a normal person and you're on the internet, <clears throat> you think of everyone else on the internet like a normal person like you. And that's just not the case. There's so many weirdos on the internet. People that, if you saw them out in the street, you'd be like, this nigga's a weirdo. But you can't see him on the internet. So when they comment, you take it at face value and you treat them like they're a normal person. And you're like, so when they give you negative feedback, you're like, what caused them to feel like that? And then you start thinking about thinking about it in yourself. Like, start judging yourself and looking, in, looking inside when really it was some random person who has no sense of self and hates everything that's going on in their own lives trying to make someone else miserable and it works because you're a normal person on a machine that is created for exactly that reason to fuck with your head that's why it's like but then you don't want to be the guy who doesn't interact with the people who follow you because then you it you like dehumanizing the people who are actually making you money and to see you as as enough of a value that they want you to succeed like and then all that gets blended in together, which fucks with your head even more. Because then it's like, are people, do people like me because I'm on YouTube? Or do they like me because I'm valued? Are they, are they only engaging because I'm there and they see me? Or are they engaging because they actually see, see what I'm saying as a value? Which is like, <clears throat> then that's weird. <clears throat> then that is a weird situation, bro. It is. I'm my biggest hater, take these pills now, I can't feel myself Why you rather see me die, listen to the shit I write I ain't a black rapper, I can still kill a mic Run the jewels, keep your flowers, I ain't trying to hear my hype My mental health is fucked, all these followers and likes Kalanapin got me nodding, ain't trying to die tonight Opposition rather see me fail, fuck them, get a life Wait, he said, he said run the jewels and keep your flowers I didn't even catch that, hold up Run the jewels, give me all the jewels, give me the money Keep your flowers, I don't care you can't, I mean, I don't know. He's jaded by the internet, is what he's saying. Hype, my mental health is fucked. Kill a mic, run the jewels, keep your flowers. I ain't trying to hear my hype. My mental health is fucked. All these followers and likes. Kalana can got me nodding, ain't trying to die tonight. Opposition rather see me fail. Fuck them, get a life. Get my middle finger too. I got my hands tattooed. It shows the pain I've been dragged through. Offer me the stomach like fast food. Take the shit away, it's past due. The bad moves, I'm about to crack like glass do. I thought we were bad, smoking pot in bathrooms. Now kids go to school and get shot in classrooms. These phones are bad news. Take away the internet now and see what that do. Uh. We were young. I wish you 
He said, I thought we were bad smoking pot in bathrooms. Now kids go to school and get shot in classrooms. This nigga's bodying, bro. What? That gave me chills. Ain't trying to die tonight. Opposition rather see me fail. Fuck them, get a life. Get my middle finger too. I got my hands tattooed. It shows the pain I've been dragged through. Offer me the stomach like fast food. Take this shit away. It's past due. The bad moves. I'm about to crack like glass do. I thought we were bad smoking pot in bathrooms. Now kids go to school and getting shot in classrooms. These phones are bad news. Take away the internet now and see what that do. We were young. I wish you could have seen. Running He's spitting. Playing in the street. Didn't care what they were saying on TV. I miss the world and the way it used to be. Used to be. Miss the world and the way it used to be. Used to be. Miss the world and the way it used to be. Used to be. Miss the world and the way it used to be. Before they poisoned us and gave us all this disease. This nigga. This nigga. He's spitting, bro. He, bro. When I first heard this nigga, I'm not gonna lie, I was like, okay, he's cool, he's cool. Like, this nigga is spitting, bro. This nigga has stepped his shit up. He stepped his shit up lyrically. Nigga spitting punchlines. Bro, there was so many, that shit was filled through a punchline. Hard for me to stomach like fast food, cracking like grack, grack, glass. Dude, like, this dude, he's doing all these different things, bro, while saying real shit at the same time. This song, to me, it literally sums up what I always thought he was like nigga is not an internet guy <laughs> like like i don't want to say a boomer but he's he's not an internet guy that's always what i thought of him like he is the opposite of what most people are most people love to post on the internet and all this like he makes skits and shit but i feel like this nigga probably probably don't know how to use a program in my <laughs> in my opinion he probably he probably couldn't open up uh davinci resolve and like edit a video maybe he could maybe he could i don't know i don't know but i just feel like he's like he's like a woods guy you know like go he could go live in a shack type of guy and and survive mm -hmm. this nigga exactly i wish i wish i miss the world in the way it used to be it sounds exactly it sums up adam calhoun to me you know what i mean but also like five years ago i would have been like this dude is he's like talking crazy you know what i mean like Okay, yeah, you're you're just stuck in the past. You want to be in the past. You don't want to see you don't want to see things move forward. This is the future. The future is now. Whatever type shit. That's how I would think. Maybe five, maybe ten years ago. I'm not gonna say five years ago. Five years ago, I noticed shit was getting a little iffy. But I think I was on the internet since I was so young that I didn't see the potential of what it could possibly be because it happened so fast. Like they had social media, MySpace. Oh, it's fun. We talked to each other. Da da da. We weren't worried about like them selling your information and like the the information wars that are happening in real time the the cyber wars this is a war on your mind you know what i mean it's a spiritual war but it's a war on your mind as well and i didn't see it coming like this i didn't but uh yeah that was facts he spit facts my man spit facts shout out adam calhoun bro shout out adam calhoun spitting facts bro appreciate your music like this man